What's going on my great people man? This is Thomas coming at you with another Tommy's World video. Today is August the 26th, 2023. You wonder where I'm at? Right now, I am at my church. Uh, supposed to be in rehearsal. I was supposed to be here at 9 o'clock. Right now it is 9.42 because I had to go take care of some family business. It wasn't nothing bad. Change a flat tire and all that crazy stuff. But anyway, no way, man. I have a wedding on today and I really want to take you guys with me. I haven't been vlogging in a while. Simple reason because I was on a cruise ship for four months. Yes, I was on a cruise ship for four months. But we'll talk about all that great stuff later. If you guys want to know, drop some comments, man. I'll make a whole nother separate video talking about the cruise ship life and how well and all that great stuff but right now i'm about to walk in on rehearsal because like i say i am super late this is tommy's world coming at you with another tommy's world video let's go late guys you can hear him i'm never late but let's go man rehearsal Woo. yeah so right now we still in rehearsal man so we just working out a couple things before i got on the cruise ship i normally was making my own click track with the mpc right. now but now I'm using a um, c right. See Dub being clutch, man, so I kind of like that. We not done by 10.45, I'm gone. I'm on a time schedule today, guys. I got to be on it. Tommy's work. We are just getting done with rehearsals. 10.54, I don't know why I was here so late. Right now, I'm about to go pack these drums up, man. Get ready for the night. I have to make a, a quick stop. Ooh, this sun is, man, guys, it's so hot in South Carolina, man. When I say it's hot, man, you see my face? Bro, yeah, it's hot. But anyway, I need to um, go buy my uh, storage before I go buy my spot and go pick up my drum. Get a couple things from my storage that I have to take for my gig today. Yeah, that time, guys. So I'm about to show you how hot it is in South Carolina. Let me show you the time first. 10.56. This is what my truck said. So I just pulled up to my um, storage. Um, what I'm about to get out of here is... Okay, so what I'm about to get out of here, man, I got my drums and stuff in here. All them boxes, snare drums, that little set, all this stuff. I got hardware. But what happened is, I have to, uh, this set will be kind of, this wedding is different, and I'm kind of doing it this way. I might be overdoing it, but then again, I do whatever I want to do anyway. So what happened is, we have to play, uh, I have to play cocktail hour. And so, the cocktail is another part of the venue, and we are playing in the stages somewhere else. My biggest thing was, I did not want to, uh, be able to move my kick drum, snare drum, and all that crazy stuff from the cocktail hour, then have to transport everything back over to the main stage. So what I'm doing is I'm taking a smaller kick drum, the little 16 inch love wig, what is it, a break beat? Yeah, the Quest Love joint. I'm taking just the kick drum. I'm just playing with kick, snare, ride cymbal. That's it. That's all I'm playing with. But it's gonna be pretty cool at the same time because I never brought a, a small kick drum for a cocktail. I normally would play my cajon. I normally would play that. I got a cajon pedal in here somewhere. But I'm gonna play with my kick drum today, man, just to give it a little more boom. So I'm not gonna keep this video long. I'm about to grab this stuff. I need to grab my tennis tom and all that great stuff. Let's go. So, got my drums packed up, ready to go. I already got my tennis tom, and I got my smaller kick drum in the car. So, for this gig, pads. I normally don't bring pads. A lot of music that we do for the wedding stuff, man, I be in my head, especially I did the cruise ship for four months. So, in my head, I just be trying to like play every part. I don't want to miss claps. No, I don't care what the song is, I don't want to miss it. So, I normally don't bring any pads, but lately I've been feeling the need to bring them. So, today, pads I'm using, are my Alesis Strike 4 pad. I do have the Roland SPDS pads. I have two of those. I also have the Roland SPDS X pads. So I got another Roland pad too. I'll show you guys in a few minutes. But today I'm using this Alesis Strike 4 pad. I was gonna give this thing away. I'm kinda glad I kept it. I'm kinda, I'm really glad that I kept this thing because I was about to give it away. And I still might give it away. It's all right pad. It's, of course it's not rolling, of course. But for, for the money and for what all you need, especially if you want something just to throw in, the, in your stick bag and let's go. Like if I go back out, or I'm not if, but when I go back out on the cruise ship, I'm taking this. I mean, it'll get the job done. Instead of taking this big pad, I just take my little small one, man. But no way, it's time to pack these drums up so I can get ready 
to get on the road, I have a long drive and I have to be there at 2.30, but I'm gonna probably get there at like 1.30, 1.45, because I got a lot of stuff to set up. It's 11.26, yeah, I have to get set up, man. We the drummers, man. Like I always say in my videos, when I normally do vlog videos and I gotta get, leave and be on time. Drummers, please be on time, because we have the most stuff, man. We have the most stuff, be on time. Cause you think about it, drums in the back, people have to set up around us. So me, I like getting there early. So if the sound man wanna mic my drums, I got everything set and he just work around me. Keyboard, bass, saxophone, guitar, whoever, they just work around me. So that's why it's good to leave early. And I have a long drive, so I need to hurry up. Where well, the drive is 22 minutes, it's right up the road. But let's go, let's get these drums loaded. Tommy's World, coming out of another video. Woo! Oh, so I told you guys I had another pad. This is the Roland SPD-1 pad. This is a good little pad. This is what I used on the cruise ship. I brought this while I was in um, Alaska. And this little joint came in handy. But I'm not using that today, I'm using this. Let's go. So man, I just got to the house, got my clothes hanging up, uh, got my drums packed, let's go. So I just pulled up to this, uh, I just pulled up. Guys, they got us outside, outside, man. Bro, we outside, bro, look at this. It's beautiful, though. I like the color scheme. But we are outside, and this is the stage that we have. Nice little dance floor. So this is where we at. Oh my God, man. These gnats, oh my God. And they look like they just cut this grass. So guys, it's gonna be one of those type gigs, man. So, but anyway or no way, we gonna make it happy, man. I'm about to set up and get out the way. Let's go. Oh my God, guys, these gnats are aggravating the heck out of me. I just got out of the car. But anyway, man, I just want to let you guys know, man, that's why it pays to be, since I'm, I'm a drummer, if you are a drummer, make sure you be on the gigs on time, man. Like, I'm the first, first person here, so I can set up, and they can just set up around me. My drums gonna be right here in the middle, and everybody else set up around me. But yeah, man, that's why it pays to get here early. I'm about to unload my truck and we go get on all these nets.
I turn y'all got it like at four o'clock. At last, my love has come along. My lonely days are over. Skies above are blue. Okay, all. My world. Guys, so here is my setup for today. Right here is the Lexus pad, sample pad four. I'm playing on my DW Design Series, the blue marine, I think they call it. It's a pretty blue too. Blue my favorite color. Yeah, so I'm playing on the DW Design Series. Um, snare drum matches as well. So you can kind of tell how I got my drum set up. I got the 10 here, I got the 12 here, and I have the 16 here. And the reason what made me do it this way, I was on a cruise ship for four months and I had to play a lot of Motown. So when I had to play a lot of Motown, it was kind of weird for me to get that Motown sound with the 12 being over there. So like now I end up putting the 12 here. So I think this will be my little setup for here on now. I kind of like it. So I got all Evans drum heads, G2s on the toms. I got the Evans heavyweight on the snare drum. I got an Evans uh, e mat on the kick. Nothing on the inside. Sounds pretty good. Pearl Eliminator. I got a, a sonar three-legged hi-hat stand. This is a good hi-hat stand because of um, it's easy to break down and it don't have that plate. So it's easy for me to like just squeeze these little bars in at the bottom. So it's easy for me to do that. I'm playing all the seals and symbols on this gig. I have a 14 inch A Custom Crash, I mean hi hats, 14 inch hi hats. I have the 17 inch Dark K Crash. I have a 22 inch uh, ride symbol. This is by far the biggest ride symbol that I ever owned. So, and it's used, and you can see it got the little dent. And the crazy thing about it is a lot of people don't know Memphis Drum Shop. I got this somewhere from Memphis Drum Shop when I got on the cruise ship because we had to rehearse in Memphis, uh, Tennessee for two weeks. So I went to Memphis Drum Shop and got this ride symbol and it's used. A lot of people don't know, but Memphis Drum Shop sell used gear. And I like the way it sounds. So I was like, man, I'm gonna get it. But yeah, so that's my 22 inch K. And I have an 18 inch EFX crash. And right here I have the Roland BT-1 bar that's got the Accord going over here to the leases pad. So I kind of got claps here and whatever. I got it set up a certain way. But yeah, man, so, and I also have the fan. I got the blower, man. And uh, yeah, so this is my setup for today, man. This is my setup for today. Yep. Walk you around this joint. Yeah, so this is my setup for today, man. DW Design Series. Oh, as you could tell too, I also have the uh, the DW Tom mount thing. When I brought this drum set, it came like that. So I didn't put that on there. It came like that when I brought it or whatever. So, and be honest with you, I kind of like this instead of having to carry extra hardware or having to clamp on the cymbal stands or whatever. So I think this right here just works perfect, just having this DW Tom mount. You can kind of see that it's offset because, I, like I said, I got the 12 here, 10 there, so it's offset. But yeah, so man, this is my setup for today. All right, guys, so uh, you guys saw that I had two kick drums or whatever, and I'm gonna let you know why I had two kick drums, but we have to play a uh, cocktail hour. So this is our area for the cocktail hour. The stage is over there. And that was the reason why I brought two kick drums. So for the cocktail hour, I'm just playing this. My little low with 16 breakbeat kick drum and my great snare drum and my insta bull 22 inch crash. This is just for cocktail hour. So no hi hat. Just these little three pieces, man. Now I'm about to take you guys to uh, the main stage. Show you guys the band members and I'm walking through my drum set. That, that's Rody, he's the MD slash guitar player sound man. So this is all his stuff. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. That's Devrin, bass player. That's Darius, the keyboard player. That's Audrey, she's a singer. 
So, so we about to get dressed and get ready. Glad you guys going on the road with me today, man. Chilling with Tommy's World with another Tommy's World video. Let me show y'all this set again. Oh my God, man, look at that. Oh my God, look at that. DW, baby, all the way. Big DW fan. And Evans fans too. But anyway, no way, man. We about to go get this thing started. I'm about to go change it to my clothes. Get ready for cocktail hour. Yeah, man, we about to do it. Tommy's world. Let's go. It's going there, but I'm late, man, for the cocktail hour. Wedding's over. We had a great time. Right now they're doing their last dance. Done, man. We done for tonight. But tonight went pretty good. 
I did get some video footage, so I can't wait to show you guys. But I want to thank you guys for going on this journey with me tonight on this vlog. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. Tell a neighbor, tell a friend, tell somebody, man, about Tommy's World. All right, guys, until next time, man. Tommy's World.